Hello, it is me, Zol, and I hope you're remembering to drink water. All right, I recently downloaded GarageBand on my phone, and we're just gonna be hopping right into GarageBand and making a song from scratch. I'm excited to see how it turns out. The general genre, I bet you can guess what kind of genre I'm going for. Bedroom pop. If you are a fan of bedroom pop, I would suggest subscribing to this channel. I make a lot of bedroom pop content, and recently I figured out that 70% of my viewers are not subscribed to the channel. So, if you could just hit that sub button, you can always unsubscribe later. That would help out a lot. Also, if you like bedroom pop, I make my own music, and every single song that I make is in collaboration with my subscribers, and they get a portion of the stream that they make a portion of the streaming revenue, so that link is down below if you want to check out my like chill bedroom pop music. Alright, enough of me talking about myself, let's hop right into GarageBand and make some music. All right, we are inside GarageBand, and GarageBand was my first DAW that I used. I use Ableton now. Um, so this is really exciting being able to just hop on GarageBand on my phone and make some music. So let's go through these instruments. I think I want to start off with a piano keyboard. There we go. Let's turn that up. Okay, let's look for... Oh, don't want to do that. Nope. Uh, this is going to take some getting used to. I think maybe if I... Yes, 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 yes. Let's go to Synth Classics. Okay, we got some arpeggiated uh, keyboards. Let's check out this Gentle Bells. Ooh, I kind of like that. Maybe we do like a... I mean, that attack is so, like, just in your face. Let's just record these uh, chords right here. We'll just do an F going into a C. Just super simple. Uh, okay. It, we're gonna have to start that over. Beautiful. We're gonna have to work a little bit on these notes because, you know, it's pretty difficult to like play the notes on your finger, but you can always do this. This is cool. I like this. Go GarageBand. I wasn't intending for this note to be right there, but I kind of like it. All right, there we go. We got our chords sounding great. Let's go to song settings. Uh, no, let's click on this plus right here. There we go. Yes, yes, yes. Let's raise this so we have a little bit more space to like structure out our song. Yeah. So the gentle bells are gonna be going, dude. Oh my god. Okay. There we go. <laughs> the gentle bells are gonna be going on throughout the song. Let's add some bass. There we go. Okay. 
So I kind of want the chords to go on like this, and then once we reach right here, the bass comes in, maybe some pads. Let's throw in a pad, actually. There we go. Loving this so far. Um, I say we add some drums now. Not a big fan of the hip hop drum machine. Let's go to Crate Digger. I like it. <clears throat> I like it. There we go. So the song is just going to start off with this little like snare thing. And then let's edit these drums right here. And let's zoom in right here. There we go. Let's add these hi-hats. I want to make the velocities like alternating, but I don't want to have to do it for every single hi-hat. So we're just going to have to not do that. There we go. Now let's just add a crash. Ooh, that's a nice crash right there. Let's go, garage then. Um, and then a kick. Is there a different kick? That kick's just way too powerful. Let's go with this guy. Ooh, I like this. Okay. Um, is there like an EQ? Ooh. Whoa! Garage Band. With the EQ 8 up in here. Let's try this. Okay. Let's definitely bump that reverb. Okay, and then we'll turn down the volume a little bit. Already so much better. Okay, this dude just needs to be a little bit lower. Oh yeah. Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, so we know that this kick is not working out. There we go. Um, yeah, I like this track, guys. I'm actually really excited to throw some, uh, some vocals on this, so... Yeah, let's just do the outro right now. I'm going to be dragging this beat into Ableton, and then I'm going to record some vocals on it. Um, there will be a snippet at the end of this video. The full song, again, is going to be down below. Yeah, get GarageBand. GarageBand's awesome. I mean, this is super nice for, like, a mobile app. Like, I can easily just make a full song like this. Um, don't forget to subscribe. Definitely helps the channel out. And thank you for watching this video to the end because that, again, is so very nice of you to watch this whole video, you know? Thanks. Peace.